Hello and welcome back. This is Double O Debbie and this is episode two of Alpha 17. My new series episode two. <laughs> so uh, yeah, I managed to crouch all through the night under under here I haven't had any incidents uh, with the zombies I, I haven't been able to put a floor down because I only have six wood left <laughs> um, I did scrap the the metal cans so that I could repair this iron reinforced club that we got last episode it's gonna be awesome it's a little bit more damage than our wooden club so that's uh, that's cool <laughs> um, there is a little bit of gravel here which that's um, promising maybe if I dig this out and I go down another five or so we'll hit the the rock area maybe and we'll start seeing some metal that would be nice if we had uh some iron down there so i'm going to carry this iron with me so that i can repair that club as needed this is all the stuff that we have as you can see i got quite a bit of clay and we found this in a chest somewhere uh really good getting that acid early on uh each uh, once you get to where you can make a bicycle, each tire takes one can of acid. So that's two wheels for a bicycle. So we're good. You know, that's the hard part of it. Um, so yeah. I'm hoping this video records okay because I'm also exporting the previous video. So. If you left a comment and I haven't responded yet, it's because I'm recording this back to back. This is probably only the the only other episode I'll be able to record today, uh, so that won't be an issue. Uh, as you can see, I'm a little bit hungry. I did go ahead and I cooked up that meat we got from the deer that we killed yesterday. Um, I charred one of the meats and then realized that, um, oh, I did spend the point in cooking. That's like the only sp point I spent so that I could get, um, the goldenrod tea recipe because I didn't have that to start out with. And I really wanted that in case we find some, uh, you know canned food out and about because we'll definitely want to supplement our bacon and eggs at first with some of the canned food so i'm going to carry this goldenrod tea with us as we go because there is another building nearby that i would like to raid that building once it becomes daylight and i'm going to go ahead and i'm going to eat this food because we're down like 33 points and this food does 36, so that'll get us good and full. And that'll be awesome. I did turn the other water that we had into yucca juice. So I'm going to check our hydration right now. You can see that on your character screen. You'll usually start here, uh, but you have to click the stats tab. And we're at 68, so I'm going to go ahead and drink one of the yucca juice as well to top us off on the thirst. So that was really good that we were next to the desert where we could find the yucca and extend our water a little bit further because <laughs> uh, I wasn't able to get uh, water the previous night. So this will be much helpful. It is just now daylight. So what I want to do is, uh, before we go to the POI, this is the trader. We're going to go ahead and mark it with what I normally do is I mark the traders with this symbol right here. 
and probably isn't really necessary that I mark him since we're so close to it. But what we're going to do is, first of all, we're going to head up to here where this water is, and we're going to fill up our water bottles. And then we're going to go check out that POI. Now, it's going to be a little bit on the dark side. I do have my gamma up uh, quite a bit. Let's see. I think it's at 100. Oh, no, it's at 63. I guess that's default. Um... Oh. oh, I had it there. We want to do that. It's really dark in the morning, so maybe we'll turn it back down once it gets a little bit lighter. But it's hard enough to, to record. I'm still getting like 30 uh, frames per second while I'm up loading the video so I'm hoping that this isn't very laggy if it is I'll know not to record uh, while I'm uploading a video and we'll definitely uh, want to hit some wood while we're going over to the water because we are very low on wood Um, I'm not going to pick up any flowers right now because I really want to get to the water and get back. That's a really big rock. I wonder if you get extra stuff from it. Alright. Um, I don't think the zombies are awake yet. I haven't seen any. Oh wait. <laughs> no. I say that and there's one right up ahead. That's okay though because we got a new weapon. Um... I normally spend my nights looking at the skill tree spending points, but I didn't really want to do that while well, I wasn't recording, so I could sort of explain why, why I choose some of the things that I choose. It's just how, I mean, you, it's really just your preferences on, on what, what you spend first and why. I keep trying to power attack and it's not working. It doesn't work with the axe. I'm so used to in my last game I had the I had the iron tools. I didn't have a I wasn't high enough to get steel tools, but I had found a steel shovel and that was pretty nice. Uh you could, pretty, you could power attack and one shot sand. <laughs> That was as far as I got. I hadn't really, you know, I think I was level 50, but I hadn't spent my points yet. So, um, another thing is that the more you use your stamina, uh, the more, um, your hunger goes. You, you use up your hunger. Um, so as you use your stamina, you get hungrier and hungrier. So if you're just sitting around doing nothing, you know, down in a hole, you you won't use up as much as if you're like, I spent the whole night digging. So of course I use up a lot of hunger. But if I had just sat there, I could have reserved, conserved my energy. So basically, it's uh, if you use it, you. <laughs> oh, look, there's a there's a house over there. I like those because they're usually pretty open. Uh, they don't have a lot in them, but I think it might be worth checking out. Oh, look, it's right by the water. <laughs> Oh, how did I miss? Yeah. Give me some medicine. No, she didn't listen. She did not listen. Okay, so let's go fill up our water. And then we'll check out this little POI right here before we go back. 
I know we're gonna we're gonna try to hit that other one too. I'm not really concerned at the moment with the rally point. We'll probably do that when we can get a fresh start once we um, maybe get our food situation under control where we can afford to um, oh look there's another gore block let's get that so we can have some extra bones all right now let's be quiet also if you travel over these papers sometimes you can make a sound even if you're crouching and the door is locked uh, but the sound is muffled a little bit uh, there is a skill a perk oh it wasn't hitting it there's a perk that makes you do less noise there is a bookshelf in here too upstairs oh i'm getting some lag uh, sometimes I get it when I go into certain buildings, and this one looks really bad, even though it, let's see, if you push F8, you can get, yeah, look at that, 9 frames per second, even though on my recording stuff it says I'm getting almost 30. It could be, I don't know. Oh, she's behind the fireplace. Come out, Big Bertha. Oh, I think there's a somber over there in the corner. No, it's just trash. Oh, there is one in that corner, though. Oh, the lag. Stupid. Come out here so I can whack you. Give me my arrow back. Okay, we're going to back up. Uh, when you hold your aim with the bow, it drains your stamina. So it's really not good to hold it that long. But I, I was, she was moving weirdly. Okay, uh, I think there's only the one guy. I didn't, I don't see anybody upstairs. You see how it's draining it two at a time? It's pretty quick. <laughs> Oh, he... Right in the back. Whoa. No touching. Touching is strictly forbidden. Okay, so that one's down. I'm thinking... Can I make um, some more wooden frames? How many can I make? I just want like ten. Ten is fine. Just so we can uh, plug up this hole. I know it's not going to keep anything out permanently, but it might give us a little bit of time that we need. Oh, there is. They were laying down. Oh, okay. Knock you back. No touching! I said no touching! Oh, the lag is so bad. Oh, why didn't she go down? Yeah, the lag is really bad down here. It wasn't as bad when I went up. Oh, look, there's a pot over there. A couple chairs. A uh, crate. To open up I, I think it this kind is just a generic cardboard box once you open it or maybe it's just random uh, oh it can be like a cupboard or a shelf or a sink or a toilet when you break it I guess not too great <laughs> but we did get an extra pot We'll keep that in case we need. I'm not going to harvest that because that's good for springs later on and we'll probably need those. 
Ooh, um, magazines. I'm not too sure what to do with the magazines. And there's a cabinet, a uh, medicine cabinet. Yeah. Uh, so this this place uh, it did have a pot which would have been great had we not already had a pot oh and it's weird because um i thought the recipe for we're gonna go ahead and scrap these cans too that's stuff to repair our weapon with um i thought the recipe for the bacon and eggs was tied behind the grill but it looks like they may have changed the recipe uh, so that it's now using the pot which is good because I don't have a grill so that's why I was able to make uh, was able to make the bacon and eggs I, don't know. I wonder what what you get if you scrap the dye Oh, it's really laggy in here. Um, let's, I think we need to check the sink. Maybe we'll get a wrench. No, but it's a coffee bean, so I guess that's okay. We're gonna scrap you. Um, let's see, what do you, can you, oh, you can't even scrap it, okay. Oh, well, we don't have much of anything. I think that was it. We're going to go ahead and take our other bottle <laughs> that we just got. Um, let's go ahead and repair this. Um, let's go fill up our other bottle so that it'll stack. And then we'll head back, drop this stuff off, maybe get that water cooking up so that it will be ready when we get back over there. Uh, we could. Uh, while we're raiding that other house, the water will be cooking, which would be nice. Oh, I hear him. Maybe he's a crawler. Yeah, there he is. These guys aren't as hard to hit anymore, but they can still break your leg. They they really did a lot to. Um, work on that uh the hit boxes which is really nice okay how are we doing on wood we got a little bit more wood we're i'm feeling a little bit better <laughs> okay so now we need to go we need to go back to our base and and drop this stuff off hitting just whatever wood we can oh look is there a trash yeah Ah, I don't really care about glass panes right now. Um, it's really good that uh, the guy has, um, our trader has a working, a workbench and a forge. That is really amazing. I like it. Uh, <laughs> so that's going to help us because we'll be able to make um, iron bars, the forged iron, in case we do accidentally come across a place that has an iron tool. It would be really nice to, uh, to be able to repair them and use them. So that will help. We can't make the iron tools yet, but we can repair them. I really think that's nice that if you do get lucky and you find one, you can repair it and keep using it. That's really nice. Oh, we're not even heading the right way. <laughs> I was distracted. Sorry. Okay. So, I think the spot we have is really good. And, um, I'm going to try and be as efficient as possible making a horde base. It's gonna be a little bit more difficult than I'm normally used to because I normally run on uh, um, the level below Nomad and like four zombies. Uh, but I found when I was doing that on my, my last uh, map, 
it just seemed really easy because you stop getting um, you stop getting the horde at midnight. So um, it was especially because I, I just had so many guns and so many bullets that uh, it just really I mean I, I, I got lucky and I found an AK and got a scope and I had tons of ammo and the second horde was just like it wasn't really a challenge so I figured I would um, do a little bit more challenging stuff on my let's play so <laughs> uh, if if I die oh there's the vulture no where's where's my stuff I hate the vultures I mean it's not like I can't kill them but it's they're so annoying they just circle around you until you're distracted and then they swoop in and try to kill you which I guess is pretty smart, but it's really annoying. So let's go um, drop some of this stuff off so we're not encumbered when we go in. Get our water boiling. I guess we can uh, destroy this and get some of our wood back. I don't know, will we get some of our wood back? Let's kind of repair this guy so he doesn't do more damage. Hopefully, let our stamina recover a little bit. Oh. So I had some thoughts. I mean, I played a little bit in the last one, and I did uh, something I normally don't do. I went into a POI, and I made the POI my base. I normally don't do that. I normally like building my own base. Uh, so... Let's throw all this stuff in here. Uh, we're going to get the water cooking. And we're going to carry that golden rod if we find some food. We're going to try and... Let's see. How long is it going to take? Two minutes? There we go. It had a little bit extra time on there and I cut it off. That's why it's, uh, normally it's 50 seconds per piece of wood and that would be 140. So I had a little bit extra on there. Because I cut the fire off. All right, let's go. Let's go to the POI and see what's gonna happen. Uh, I wanna do, that one's too big. Let's go into this one. Um, we'll go upstairs and we'll do a top down, top down strategy. Um, ooh, ooh, quietly, quietly. We're going to pick up all these chairs and scrap them because that's, uh, easy wood. It's not free. But it is easy because you don't have to break them. Okay, let's go up. <laughs> Sometimes there are zombies on the top. That's why I wanted to come up here. Oh, you can see. All I wonder what would they do if I break some of this glass and try to shoot at them? Will they try to climb up the ladder? I don't think that would be very desirable. As soon as we get on the ladder, we're not going to be sneaking anymore. Okay. You can't sneak while you're even on a ladder. Shoot. You are nothing. You are nothing. I think I woke one of them up, and there's one. Okay, here he comes. Let's get it down. There. And let's get our weapon ready. 
because I think he woke up the whole house. Yeah, look, there's somebody coming up the stairs. Can I get him? Just be patient. One more hit. Ah, hey, one at a time, one at a time. Make a line, please. Oh, we gotta... Oh, no! We're bleeding! Okay, we're not bleeding now. Get some stamina back. I would have really rather have used my arrows, but they were already awake. Okay, he's down. We made a level. I think. Oh, look, they're coming down. They're jumping down. heard something. Okay, we're a little bit damaged. Okay, we're gonna back up and use our bow. Come on. Don't miss. Don't miss. They did a lot better about, like, I think, with having the mobs respawn, you know, in the POIs when you go a little distance away. Which was really annoying because you'd go and you pull them all out and you start fighting them and you kill them off and you go back in and, what? They've all respawned? That stinks. So, it's better now. I haven't seen them respawn on me yet. Spazzy boy! Hold still, please. Just a little bit. Oh my gosh. That's what... It's great that they all line up like that. That way if you miss one, you might hit... You might hit the next one in line. Or not. Okay, there's one down. She's new. Yeah, so it really doesn't matter early on if you get them in the head or not because you don't get the bonus damage for headshots. Not until you put points into it. So shooting them in the chest is just as much damage as shooting them in the head. And it's easier to shoot them in the chest because it's a bigger target. like going through and shooting them in the head or whatever if you want to do the most damage that you can uh, to anything. Oh look, they dropped the arrows on the ground. I wonder if there's still any over here. Did we? Yeah, I don't think we got. So that should be it <laughs> maybe. I think. Let's go upstairs, because the door's open up there. Uh, the top looks clear, and we went up top, so I know there's not one up there. Sometimes there are guys in the rooms in here. So we'll have to see. Maybe they were... Oh, there's one back there, see, under the desk. And there could be one in here. <laughs> right in the eye! Right in the eye. He got a problem. Oh, it's in the back of his head. Sticking out through his eye. Okay, let's see. Is there a guy in here? Maybe he got woke up. Maybe he didn't. Okay, no guy in here, but sometimes there are guys in this room. Oh. Uh, yeah, I see, I see somebody back there. Sort of. 
I wonder if they're going to wake up. I can sort of see through the cracks. It looks like, uh... There was, yeah, you can see his shirt right there. He's not waking up, though. That's weird. Let's get a little bit of stamina back. And get this thing uh, opened up. There we go. I'm surprised he hasn't woken up yet. Okay, let's get some more stamina back. Uh, I'm not going to be able to open the safe. I'm going to wait until I get an iron pick or something. Because uh, I just can't stand waiting, standing there that long to open a safe with a stone pickaxe. A stone axe. Okay, a little bit left. Let's get our stamina back so that when we break it, we'll be able to clobber him. Okay, let's hope we find some food in here. Alright, let's get our free shot in. He's still sleeping. No! Stay down. Now I'm getting my arrow back. Thank you. I like getting some arrows back. So there's nothing in here besides the safe. Um... Well, let's go ahead and repair our axe. We definitely want to get these blinds. Uh, that's a good source of plastic. Not many sources of plastic. I guess uh, now you just get plastic from looting tires. Um, but uh, you get a better results if you use a wrench. So let's open this crate. So we don't have a wrench, so this is pretty much the only source of plastic is from the blinds when we find them. Ooh, cabinet, food please. Some, some, oh, I want to save the salmon though, because there's a recipe, if you look, for fish tacos, and all you need is cornmeal with it, and it's really good food, but you have to, um, you have to save it for when you get the recipe. Or the, the food, which which is uh, pretty far down the tree, I think. I think it's the third one. Learn how to make sham chowder. Um, I think it's either with the third one or the second one. I'm not sure. All right. Um, we don't need the chair or and there's nothing in the desk. Ooh, a poncho! Yeah, oh, we have a... Uh, you know what? The poncho isn't as good as what we have. What we have is, like, way freaking better. So, the poncho is good. Maybe we'll be able to sell it or something at the trader. Uh, we're just gonna scrap the can. I know we'll get cans, uh, the canned food and stuff. Nothing in the toilet, huh? Not even some dirty water. Ooh, a nice bandage and some steroids. Okay. Wow, I feel really laggy in here. Yeah, it's only like 18. I guess it could be worse. Get some free paper. Uh, oh yeah, and the chairs. Uh, also, these these chairs are leather. They're good for leather. You break them. Which we're still going to need like to get at least 20. Uh, 20 leathers so that when we do make 20th level, we have what we need for the forge. Uh, so, I mean, we have easy access to the trader nearby. I don't know that these give leather. I wonder if they do. I guess we're gonna find out here shortly. Oh, I can't believe I can't believe I might have to wind up. How can you equip a chair? Uh I'm gonna loot one of those chairs and try to Oh they do give you leather. That's good. Okay, are there any blinds? Uh, no. What about this? Did I loot this already? 
Oh, it's open, so I guess you can't loot it. The refrigerator, the bottom looks untouched. Oh, meat stew! Oh, thank you. Oh, another meat stew. Oh, that was awesome. Under the sink, more coffee. A wall oven, some coal. That one's not empty. Oh, meat stew. Okay, that looks like it. Now we just need to gather. I want to try to equip this chair. How do you equip a chair? Oh, it just goes to your hot bar. I thought it would. <laughs> what? Okay, uh, scrap it. Okay, so that's not exactly what I thought was going to happen. I thought he was going to put it on your back or something. <laughs> something silly, I guess. Oh, look, they damaged that. Oh, they damaged this really bad. Okay, get that chair. I'm going to get all the chairs and scrap them for free wood. I don't know if there's like any secret places in this. Um, uh, this is an, one of the old POIs that I remember. You know, that one is a new one. It's a pretty big building. Um, we actually have enough time. I think we might be able to go over there and check it out. Uh, a lot of the newer POIs have secret little stashes where they either you find it and it's like um uh, actually let's go drop all this stuff off and then we'll head over there oh yeah we're gonna have a meat stew first though because we're a little bit low on health from the those zombies that that struck us uh, the rotten flesh. There are so many new recipes. Uh, we're just gonna dump all of this stuff except for that. Uh, scrap you. A scrap you and a scrap you too. Yeah. Oh yeah. Okay, so we're. You get 47 max stamina and 24 health and 20 water from this. It's awesome. I love it. <laughs> uh, so that's good. We're going to eat one of them. And then we're going to put another one in the campfire. Uh, it looks like we're, we're down a little bit on the water. But I think we'll be okay. We're going to keep... Uh, we're going to... Keep that golden rod on us in case there's some canned food over there um, that we can eat. As long as it's not salmon. Um, and you definitely don't want to eat raw sham sandwiches anymore because that's a hundred percent chance to get food poisoning. A hundred percent. And food poisoning is no joke now. It's not something that you just, oh, I'll just eat it while I'm hiding in my hole at night. No, because it damages you. Um, it not only damages you physically, like uh, takes your hip, it takes your max health down. So you lose max health and the hit points that you had. So if you're at full health, your max hit points go down. You're still at full health, but you don't have those hit points anymore. Uh, so, and it drains your stamina. Like, it drains your stamina before, but you were like, well, if I'm just sitting in my hole, it doesn't really matter. Uh, okay. So, I think I went into a POI like this before in my other game. Let's get these spikes down. I wonder why you can't make these spikes anymore. Um... So, we're good with our stamina. Let's get a little bit of stamina back. Now that we're 100% hydrated, we'll get our stamina back faster. We're going to make noise whether we're sneaking or not. So, I'm just going to 
bust through this. Okay, let's get a, get our stamina back so that uh, when we bust this door down, we're not like getting clobbered because we can't swing. And I'm gonna go ahead and repair this. There we go. I really like how it puts it right back in the same spot on your hot bar. Oh look, there's a barricade behind the door. Okay. Pop the door off. Take a look around to see if we have friends. It doesn't look like we have any friends. And I don't know um, if the hiding, the hidey holes uh, are all static or if they just randomly appear. Um, if they're in the same spots every time, I don't know. Uh, I only like went into one house like this. Okay, now it's time for stealth mode. I haven't spent any of my points. I'm, <laughs> I'm such a noob. I should be spending my points at least to, you know, reduce the stamina cost from from melee. Clear over here. Oh, look at that bookshelf. I really want that bookshelf. So get it. <gasps> I keep hoping to get a mod. Because uh, I think that would be the place. We're not going to really loot anything till we make sure we've got the all clear. I just really wanted to loot that. Uh, okay, so that part is blocked off to us, and so is that. Uh, so let's sneak upstairs and see if we can uh, see if we'll be able to take any of them out without much of a fuss. Shh. There's some landmines over there too. Um, uh, birds. I'm starting to get laggy. Here's one. Oh, she woke up. Oh, I'm so laggy from the, the lag from the house. I don't like it. Uh oh, there's another one. I need to stop the bleeding. Oh crap. Ah, uh, oh no, 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 no. Let me out. Okay, get the bandage. That's way too many. Oh, they set off the bombs. Oh my god. <laughs> they took the wrong turn at Albuquerque. Um, dude, we are so jacked. Uh, at least they blew themselves up. That was nice. That was freaking awesome. <laughs> Oh yeah. Okay. They're still up there banging on the spikes. Um, I think what I want to do is I want to go back and since we have some water now, we know where to get water. I'm going to go uh, use one of those pills that I have to get some health back. <laughs> uh, I should just go in there and die, I guess. But... Oh, plus I'm sick. Oh, I don't feel so good. Let's just use one of those. And, um... Now, I did watch in, like, um... Games for Kicks Let's Play. He found out that... Oh, was it him? Or... Cage, uh... If you pop two painkillers, the second one, you don't get that bonus if you have the painkiller effect already. So we're not going to, we're not going to do that. Okay. We got a little bit of health back. I feel better. Um, I'm really not liking that lag in the house. Uh, I think it might have something to do with 
recording, but uh, I did notice like in the POI that I uh, I basically took over in the last uh, in in my first game. Um, it was laggy in there and I wasn't recording. So I don't think it's just that I'm recording the, the, the reason why it's lagging so much. Okay, so that was uh, a bit more than I was expecting to find up there. Let's try to be a little bit quieter. I didn't think waking that one zombie up was going to trigger like five. And it looks like they, they set those bombs off, two of them. But it didn't do a whole lot of damage. At least we still got this trash here that had a glue. Glue is good. Okay. Let's try to sneak over here. Um, I think this is in the other room. So you can get here. Yeah, just by busting through that way. That would have been much better. Uh... But there's stuff in here, but let's try to make sure it's clear in here so I don't want to get snuck up on. Um, we're going to have to break these down to get to the other side. Um, you know what? Those doors are fortified. Why don't we try doing this one? It will make less noise. stamina. Maybe we should, uh, we're okay right here. Maybe we should get something that will help us with our stamina. Uh, especially while we're fighting. The sexual Tyrannosaurus is, uh, by 10% just for melee. So I think that's going to be good, important thing. Um, I also, I think I want this because I like when I knock them down. I really like when I knock them down. So we're at 73% water already. Wow. I think that was because we... Okay. There's nobody in here. What about over here? Oh, yeah. <gasps> oh, my God. Look at all of them. I wonder if I can just hit one. And back up and pull it. Okay, it's not coming towards me. I think it's trying to go out the door. Where is it? Oh, it's going right there. Alright, let's help it. Where are you going, lady? Crutch shot! <laughs> Ow, that had to have hurt. That's all I can hit. Oh, yeah. Okay, so it looks like... Maybe it might be better to go through here. So they, they'll follow out this way. Um, let me repair this. And, okay, I got 42 arrows. I think that might be enough. Okay, it looks like she came through here. Okay, let's be very quiet. Get a slight recoil from it. Seriously, I'm not hitting her. I'm going to... There we go. 
Got her in the neck. Oh, shoot. Just get the weapon ready. She hit me. I gotta, I gotta not let them hit me. Okay, shh. Get rid of these so I don't accidentally wake them up stepping on one of these stupid things. That's a lot of zomberts. In the last game, I didn't ever have that many in one room. You know, maybe two or three, but six? Five or six? Man. Seriously? Is that something coming out of her shoulder? Is that like her ponytail? That's her ponytail. Okay. I'm going to switch to my weapon so that... Because it's a little bit laggy in here still. Oh! No, I woke her up from hitting. I woke her up from hitting. Hitting the wall. Oh. Oh, she's big and she's not going down. Go down. Stay down. You're supposed to knock them down. <sighs> okay. We're good now. We only got one left. Okay. Did I? I didn't shoot her, but did I shoot her? Okay. It's all good. Okay. Um, I didn't see a way over to the other side. Um, this is like a little hidey hole right here. With the hidden supplies. Looks like maybe a trash can in there. Oh, look. It's 12 o'clock already. Oh! A hunting knife. Oh, that is awesome. Can you still not do anything with that? Okay, we're going to drop it by pushing D and get our bottles. Oh, that was awesome. A uh, hunting knife means we'll get more uh, when we harvest animals. So that's always good. Okay, um, we, we got to check behind the paintings too. I found a lot. Yeah, look at that. A wooden chest behind the painting. Eh, not so good in there. Uh, there is another one over here. I think we'll go through the front since it's only got a hundred. Whoa! A sham sandwich! Which you definitely do not want to eat. You want to save those. Because you get 100% food poisoning. And if you get that third set of... Uh, Cooking skill. Dude, you can make sham chowder and it's so freaking awesome. I don't know. Do you get uh, steel arrowheads? Do you get springs from those? Oh, I think we still haven't. Isn't there like, yeah, look, there's a ceiling that's missing up there. More coffee. Good. Coffee is good, but um, it helps. Oh, good. We got some water. We don't have to run all the way over there. We got more Zomberts. I think they're up, but I don't know how to get up. Must be in the other side of. Oh, man. Okay. I don't want to loot and wake them up, but I don't know how to get over there without getting blowed up. Um, it looks like they broke through. 
out here. Oh, no, I don't want to go out. I don't want to go out. Help me, help me. Okay, let's try not to loot anything. I just want to go... I want to get over there. So I think I'm going to make... Um, just make a platform. Oh, it's so laggy. Just make this to walk over there. But there is a... Uh, that little ledge right there. Look at all those landmines. Oh my god, how am I going to get over that? Put that there. Put that there. I want it to go, I guess, can I destroy this? The stupid sticky out part? Yeah, that's what I want right there. That way we can go, go around the landmines. Because I don't want to, I don't want to set those off. Okay, that should be good, I think. Now we can just, um, let's repair our axe. Uh, A, repair. I have to really watch that hubcap. Um, so I don't set that off. There's got to be a way to get upstairs. Okay, that just goes around to that room right there. Maybe it'll be easier to get in and we'll bypass those landmines if we go around this way. Maybe go in through a window. Ah, uh, yeah, and look, there's another part of the stuff over here. There we go. That's what I want. All right? Can I not put it? I need some more wood frames. Eleven. That's good. Eleventy-five of them. Let's go over here. Oh. Woo! Okay. I see you now. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Seriously. Keep hitting the door frame. Oh! Bad things are happening! Bad things are happening! I don't like it! <sighs> That's the sound of the zombies working on the same game! Oh my goodness! There's a zombie down. She fell down. I don't know that she died though. She's going to be trying to sneak up on it. Where'd she go? There she is. 
Ha ha! Got you in the butt! <laughs> okay. I'm at 46 health. This is so dangerous. I should go back. Okay, but I think we may have gotten everybody from over here. Taken care of. Where is the entrance to the attic? <laughs> I think we might just have to go back to that hole in the roof, in the ceiling. Um, and just make a little nerd pull up. Let's go do that. It was, in, it was on the other side of the house. That way we can uh, get it taken care of. And I'm still a little bit laggy over here. Okay, I think it was over this way. Yeah, here it is. Can I put it right there? Push me. Lag. Lag. Lag, lag, lag. Oh. Oh, jeez. I'm so low on health. I don't have enough stamina. Oh, no. Go down. Go down. Go down. No. Oh. Someone else awake somewhere. Okay, I'm going to retreat strategically. I'm not running away. I will be back. <laughs> Mommy. Oh my goodness. Seven hit points. Ouchie boo boos. Okay, I'm gonna use one of those good bandages. <sighs> use that. Oh, increase my cap some. I'm gonna use a normal one too. Um. I hear them breaking things over there. Okay. Oh my goodness, they're following me. I wonder if they're going to come down here. Um, let me get this quickly and then Oh, it's up there breathing down my neck. Woo! Stay away! This is my house. You don't belong here. Bad zombie. No biscuits. Oh, he totally made it. Oh, there's a garage too. We haven't gone to the garage. they came out here it's a little bit less laggy Go over here where we're not in the desert getting hot whoa whoa stop spazzing out please can't hit you if you spaz Oh, how did she 
not die from that. I'd rather fight them out here than in there, man. Oh, I missed. Oh. Still a little bit laggy. Just even close to that house. I think um, I'm done uploading or saving my video, so... Oh, dude! Just, oh, it leveled me up. I only got 228 from him instead of 700. Come on! No! There we go, there we go. Okay. Narrowly escaped destruction. Why did you get knocked down? Okay, they all came from over here. There's no way they got through there. Oh, there's like a whole butt ton of them back here. Okay, she's down. Good. Whoa! No touching! I have a strict no touching policy. Touching costs extra. Okay, it looks like maybe they... I can't believe they didn't destroy this stuff. Three claw. What's in here? Oh, Painville. Good. I need that. Did they not? They didn't come out? in here. 225? I thought these things only had a hundred. Oh. Looks like we woke something else up. <sighs> Take a step back. Repair our little axe. Get some stamina back. Everything's metal. <sighs> Can't wait to get this cleared out and we can actually start looting. Oh man, it's 15 o'clock! Oh, that guy hurt us. I'm glad I checked. We're gonna kill him and repair our weapon. Whoa! No, 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 no touching. I will not allow it. Not on purpose, anyway. Okay, let's go ahead and repair that. It only take seven. Seven scrap iron. But it's worth it. Oh, kitty, no, kitty, no, kitty. No, 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 kitty. Oh, no. Look at that. They're gonna blow up one of the cars. I just know it. Right in the ding ding. <laughs> He never got a chance to get the car.
Oh, I missed. Don't swing at the car. In the middle of the forehead. That one split the arrow. He's still not down. Look, I only have 17 arrows left. Can you please give me my arrow back, sir? Thank you. Thank you. That was mighty kind of you. I, I almost feel like I should thank you by letting you live, but it's not going to happen. Sorry. Okay. Let's try and see if we can get that last guy without blowing up a car. I don't think I can. Oh. Oof! A leg! Let's go him outside. I don't want to be in there and get blown up by an idiot zombie. Hey, can I have my arrow? Thanks. Oh no! Booty up! Still booty up! Okay. Already looted that. Looks like there's some stuff. Oh, look at that. There's a Zombert up top. Uh, I wonder if I... Can I get... Can I shoot him? From here. <laughs> what a shot. Yeah, you can't hit me from up there, mister. Uh-oh. I have a feeling. He's going to be the one to explode the car. Oh, he fell down. Good. Oh. Don't hit the car. Oh man, this is tense. This is a hard POI. Thank you, thank you, thank you. There's so many zombies in there. Holy cow. Okay. I think maybe that might be all of them in the whole house. Look. There's a working workbench right here. Oh, look, an arrow. Okay, there's tons of stuff to loot. I'm wondering, are we all done? This is stuff that we couldn't get to. Is it clear? Oh, I definitely want to... I want to check out these Shamway boxes. Get a little privacy. Do a little sneaky sneaky in case there are more Zomberts. A glass bottle. Looks like just me and the Shamway shipping crates. Oh yeah. Hope there's some more meat stew or something in there. Oh, one piece of corn, seriously. Oh. I was really hoping for a meat stew. Oh, blueberry pie. That's not as good as a meat stew. Actually, 
Uh, let's take everything. I think the, sh the sham sandwiches aren't used in anything. So let's go ahead and eat one of those. Actually, both of them. If we get food poisoning, I got that goldenrod tea. There we go. Oh, man. I hate that. I don't want email notifications on my computer. That's what I have my phone for. Jeez. It only does that when I'm recording. It's never done that before. We're going to get rid of the one clay soil. Okay. We're at 100 of 100 now. And we have a blueberry pie. Um, I think we may have cleared them all. So we're going to... We're going to start looting. Oh, look. Why is this different? Is there something under here? No. Okay, let's fix it. Okay. Normally, when the, in these new POIs, if you see something like a... Uh, a board out of place or something there it's probably uh, something <coughs> hidden behind it. paint paint in the kitchen the bullets in under the sink the microwave so not a whole lot of food there but a lot of bottles did I check the trash can yes I did okay let's just loot the crap out of this house nothing that looks out of place here lots of cupboards though awesome water yes some more water. Good. More cans. I'm not very excited about that, but okay. It's a little bit more metal. I, I don't really need to eat that right now, so I'm not going to. Oh, a can of chili. Yeah. Oh, that's so good. Okay, nothing in here except for this garbage. Let's go back out to the garage. Let's get that. Get that out of the way because we can go through there. I guess we can go around the long way through the sham, uh, the sham closet. I don't know. Let's go see. Oh, look. Uh, my arrow. Let's go see what the garage has to offer. I know there's some... Oh, another sham sandwich. Those are going to be really good. Oh, and there's a box over here that I didn't see before. Oh, that's empty. <laughs> and they love hiding stuff on the tops of the shelves. But there's none over there. And we already checked that box. Um... Oh, look, here's some trash here. Oh, a mushroom spore. Good, that'll be good for our farm. Oh, there's another, another part. Okay, before we go over there, let's check up in the rafters up here because I saw some boxes. There's another arrow. So there's like, Look up there. You see there's a working stiff tools crate. How can we get up there? Okay, I should be able to. Excellent. Um, there's another one way over there and a box. So let's see. 
I can't reach it from here. <laughs> There we go. Now we can reach it. Come on, be something good. <laughs> Come to mama. We'll be using you. See, and now we can go and take some of our, our iron ore. Oh, it's so laggy in here. We can take some of our iron ore and smelt it up and be able to repair this. Oh, that is so awesome. All right, let's go. Where can I get to both of them? Maybe right here? Ugh. Oh. Placed it above? so confusing okay there we go oh another working stiff tools maybe they'll give me an axe that would be awesome eight mechanical parts there's nothing wrong with that nothing wrong with that at all it's 17 o'clock oh my god I don't know that We'll be able to finish this, uh, this place. It's 4.30. My kids are going to be getting home any second now. Uh, let's go check out this place real quick. Nothing over here. Oh, look, there's some garbage in a bag. Oh, some bullets. Another hunting knife. I'm going to go ahead and scrap those and scrap that and scrap those. Uh, we can melt that down, I guess, and get some more stuff. Okay, now we're back into the main area. Let's try to loot this real quick. We'll loot this room and then we're probably gonna have to give me a bomb. Yes. Uh actually it didn't give me a bone. Am I full? I'm not full. Well that stinks. I didn't think it would not have a chance to give bones. And that was the oh, steel arrows. Uh, that was the, the bookshelf I believe I looted as we came in. Get all the yummy cloth. Uh, check behind the wall, the paintings. Nothing. There's something in the desk. Oh! We're going to use that. What we have is worse. It's minus. This is what you have on and this is the current stat. So that's telling us that it's 1-1. One, one, I believe for the... Yeah. So let's scrap those. Get our leather. Real quick. We're going to do this room and then we'll come back in the next episode and probably finish it up because we're running out of time, daylight time. Okay, and it's a little bit laggy and my kids are going to be home soon. So, we'll just loot this up real quick, get this leather, head back. And then we'll come back and we'll loot the rest of it. Did I get that garbage? No. Oh, I'm so encumbered. Is there something behind this? Oh, it needs repairs. Alright, we're going to go ahead and go. I'm going to make sure, yep. 
we're going to go out the back way because it's closer to the house. There we go. Huh. Straight out the back door. How's that come for convenience? Uh, uh, where's my house? Where's my house? There it is. Oh, look, he, he heard it. Poor housey. Heard that too. So apparently if they are on you, they will come and they can hit blocks downwards. So they have fixed that. So let's put all our stuff in here. Just throw everything in. It's getting so full. All right. So <laughs> there we go. 18 o'clock. I'll probably... Um, spend that time offline um, just gathering up some wood and stone before nightfall and I won't be recording that because uh, that's pretty unexciting uh, so yeah we got a little bit better on our food we got some canned food from the house that was excellent uh, got some more water bottles and uh, more water, which is good. Um, I will feel better. I want to gather some more rocks so I can at least make um, the layout that I have in my head for the base that I want. Um, so I can at least get the base structure down so that if I do have to retreat, I can go up top instead of going down. Since I know they can dig down, and I'll have a, a, a way to, you know, shoot at them from above without, uh, you know, because going down is bad. Because when you go up to get them, they have a, you know, a chance to attack you without you being ready. But if I go up then I could shoot down at them and that would be good. So anyway, <laughs> thank you for watching. And uh, if you did like the video, leave a like. If you didn't, then just go away. <laughs> no, I don't care. Say you didn't like it. Uh, comment below, whatever. Uh, if you haven't already, please subscribe and we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.